to make my favorite bourbon pecan pie, start by heating your oven to 425 degrees and then on the stovetop melting a half a cup of butter. While you're doing that, beat three eggs along with a teaspoon of salt, a teaspoon of vanilla extract, then add a teaspoon of fresh lemon juice, and now for the sugars. It's half a cup of firmly packed brown sugar, half a cup of granulated sugar, and one cup of dark corn syrup. You can use molasses if you prefer. It's easier to uh, find the corn syrup though. Then add my secret sauce, and in this case, that's Woodford Reserve's double oak. I used a double oak because it just gives pecan pie that extra bit of fall flavor. Stir your butter into that, mix it all well, make sure those sugars are really nicely blended. Yeah, there's enough sugar in this thing to give a moose diabetes. What? And then add your coarsely chopped pecans. Here I'm using about a half cup. I used coarsely chopped because, well, they're just cheaper. Now, your pie crust can either be pre-made um, or you can make it at home. But just make sure it's nine inches because that's what we're making here is a nine inch pie. And just fill that sucker with your pecans and sugars and butters and bourbon and try not to stick your face in it. And then you'll want to decorate the top of this thing with one cup of pecan halves. Now be judicious with these because pecan halves are pretty pricey this time of year. Once you've got that all done, slip it into the oven at 425 degrees for 10 minutes and then reduce the heat to 325 degrees and bake for another 40 to 45 minutes. Just don't cut into it until it's nice and cool. Not only is this my favorite pecan pie recipe in the world because it's so delicious, it's also a sentimental favorite for me. I was stationed in Afghanistan and all Americans serving in Afghanistan operate under general order number one, which outlaws alcohol, so bourbon's out. It outlaws bacon. Ugh and it outlaws uh, grown folk relations, I think is how I put that. Anyway, all that a man's soul desires. But one of my shipmate friends there, his father would send us this bourbon laced pecan pie. And if it's possible to snort a pecan pie, we did, it's just that delicious. It's a real taste of home. And today, whenever I dig into this pecan pie, mm, I just think about it as America on a plate.